Hello ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome to you. My name is Alex of Small Cars Direct here in New Milton, Hampshire, and I'm here to present this rather sharp looking 2016 16 registered Suzuki Vitara SZT. Just a two owner from New Example. Benefits from road tax are just £160 a year. Insurance group is a low 15 out of 50. It's very affordable in terms of running costs because it can achieve anything up to 58 miles per gallon. Mileage, just 53,758 miles from you. So code barely five years worth of mileage. Yet it's been serviced seven times at 16, 25, 30, 33, 37, 43, 51,297, which was just 2,000 miles ago. It does sit on these uh, rather nice, classy looking 17 inch, what are they, anthracite grey alloy wheels. And they're wrapped in tyres that have ample amounts of tread remaining. It's a high spec car as well, actually. It's got the roof bars there just for aesthetics. And then moving to the rear, you'll notice you've got the reverse park camera, which I'll show you from the inside of the cabin as well. Nice bright chrome effect badging to the exterior, which is all in nice condition. You've got the privacy glass, as you can see, to the rear and the side windows back here as well. Zooming in on the wheels, there are some minor marks to the wheels to be expected. This vehicle ultimately is, what, eight years of age? It's getting nice and close. In the name of transparency, you'll be able to spot those. Or not as the case may be, as they're quite small. And here's the tyres. We'll zoom in on all four corners for you as well. Inside, you've got cruise control. You've actually also got Apple CarPlay as well. So gives you use of all the popular apps, Waze, Google Maps, WhatsApp, as long as you've got those on your phone, obviously. It does come complete with two keys as well. Got the heated door mirrors. They're electrically adjustable. Screens looking nice and clear as well. There's no large chips. Certainly no cracks anywhere at all. Moisture inside the headlights, no none. Headlights looking nice and clear as well. Daytime running lights, front fog lights. Nice, nice uh, chrome badging on the front. The grey grille does look very sharp. Just a few minor stone chips, which appear to have been touched in, which is good. But very small and minor, really, considering. You know, take a step back. Can't say any really stand out. A couple of small marks here again, which appear to have been touched in, but they are probably, I'd say, the worst on the whole car, which. Considering uh, it's done over 50,000 miles, eight years old, it's really, really good because the rest of the car, I must say, it's really, really clean. Looking down the side here on this near side, there's nothing major that stands out at all. And that wing mirror housing is looking nice and clean as well. Let's get a close look at this wheel. Probably the worst wheel, but again, still presentable in its uh, appearance. And then this tyre then, got ample amounts of tread left there. Same on this one as well. The vehicle will benefit from an MOT that will run to August 2025. And uh, let's take a quick look inside then for you. If you haven't already done so, guys, check out our reviews. We've got over 300 five-star reviews online for the business here at Small Cars Direct. So check those out, see what our customers have to say about us. We do deliver nationwide as well. So if you're considering have this vehicle delivered to your place of home or work, it is possible. Just let us know your uh, postcode. Nice white stitching to the seats there. And we'll get you a price to deliver. And uh, we do offer finance as well with rates starting from just 9.9% APR for those with an A1 credit score. And uh, decisions as quick as 10 minutes during normal working hours as well. So... If you want a quick finance decision, then uh, get in touch or actually just uh, visit the Small Cars Direct website and you can actually scroll down the page on the Vitara and actually apply from the comfort of your own home and get a decision instantly. Then you'll be able to drive away. Side airbags, obviously. 
on the front there, as you can see. Take a quick look in the boot, you've got a split level boot floor, um, which basically allows you to keep any items from rolling around too much. Just place them underneath here. And then underneath here, you've got another layer, which has your tire compressor and sealant kit and tow eye and wheel wrench. You've actually got a locking wheel nut in the glove box in the front. Got some extra cubby holes left and right there. A little hook for holding a bag. You've actually got a 12 volt socket port and light there. Parcel shelf is present. Let's close that up. Let's show you the car from this angle. Inside again, all looking nice and clear, nice to see three actual seat belts there as well. Isofix points obviously in the rear. There's a couple of minor marks on the interior door panel, but again, nothing really to write home about. There's one little mark just in here inside the door. See someone's caught the seat belt on there's one down there as well. Small little mark down there. Um, and scanning down the side of the car, like I say, just as fresh as the rest, really. Just a couple of small little dents in there, one there, I think you've got one just there, but again, I'm, I'm being very picky, but I, I must be picky because ultimately I want you guys, if you're traveling far afield, to um, to actually be pleasantly surprised by its condition rather than disappointed. And uh, here is the driver's seat base height adjuster, electrically adjustable door mirrors, four electric windows. Let's just jump in then and I'll show you the car starting, show you the cruise control features on the steering wheel, and um, central nav display, which houses the Apple CarPlay. Air conditioning is actually, just tried the air conditioning, it's working nice and cold actually, so that's good. A five speed manual gearbox, a couple of cup holders and another little separate cubby hole back there. Let's uh, just show you the Apple CarPlay and show you it's all working. Let's give it a chance to, uh, to load up, just plug my phone in. Fifty three thousand seven hundred and fifty eight miles from you. Let's show you the nav. Got DAB radio on here as well as the usual Bluetooth. Let's try the AC actually to confirm. I'm sure that's working. There we go. There we go. Got the Apple CarPlay showing all the very popular apps, WhatsApp, Waze, Google Maps. As long as they're on your phone, you can access those, which is absolutely fantastic um, to be able to. You can actually send messages on the move. You can actually get WhatsApp. Would you like me to read your messages, compose a new oh, one, amazing. or make a call? Brilliant, isn't it? And then go to Nav. Obviously got navigation. Mm -hmm. It looks like Nav doesn't have WA business messages enabled. <laughs> Who do you want to send it? You've got, uh, you've got navigation on here as well. Give it a little rev, so it's revs fine. 120, uh, 120 horsepower engine, which is more than enough. And if you've got any questions, get, yourself, uh, get in touch with myself, Alex, or my colleague John here at Small Cars. So we do offer part exchange, so please do get in touch if you're interested in part exchanging your car. We're offering very strong prices at the moment, so let us know your reg and your mileage, and we get We'll get you a price to part exchange your vehicle here with us. And uh, that's about it. If you've got any questions, like I say, get in touch. I hope this video has been of use. And uh, hopefully we'll hear from some of you guys soon. Thanks for watching.